In data cleaning, most important thing is that how can you remove duplicates in your data? Mostly in interviews, that type of question is asked to candidate. I'm going to show you three method. Each have their own advantages and disadvantages. When we apply these methods, every time the result is different. How to use these methods? Let's take a look. I am Farhan. You are watching Digi Mastery channel. This is Microsoft Excel series. Let's start. So I have this table with sale person, region and sale values. I want to remove duplicate occur in data set. First we look what are the duplicates. You can see this record and see this record. This is not duplicate because sale values are different. If you can see here both records that is duplicate. I want to remove this duplicate in whole data set. Method 1. If you want to keep original data set, press Ctrl A and then again press Ctrl A to select header also. Now press Ctrl C. Select this cell and paste here also with same format. Click inside data set and go to data tab. Now select this option remove duplicates. Now new window is open. Just check mark this my data has headers. Columns are already selected then press OK. You can see three duplicates values found and remove and 24 unique values. Click OK. Now you can see result which all values are unique. Now here if you want to remove only sale person column duplicates. First you select this column and press Ctrl C and Ctrl V here. Then go to data tab and select this remove duplicate. This time 20 duplicates value found and remove and 7 unique values remain. Ok delete this. Method 2. In this method, we use formula that is unique formula. Select this cell and now enter is equal to sign. Write unique bracket start. Now here is first argument array. For array selection, just go here when you see this arrow just click this action select your entire table that is array that's all i need close the bracket and press enter you can see unique list after remove duplicates just copy and paste header here and apply sale value formatting like this. The difference of first and second method is the second method is dynamic. Let's take a look. 
if I copy this record and paste here you can see there is no change because duplicates automatically remove if I change this sale value then you can see in second method that record is automatically update but in first method there is no change for this change in first method I would have to repeat these steps to get my unique list Now in third method we use power query. This method is semi dynamic because in this method to update record every time we press fresh. Now go to data tab and this time I am going to this data tool get and transform data. First we get data, then we transform this data, our data is here. Click on inside data set, then choose this option from sheet. Now power query editor open in front of us. Don't worry about this, we just simple step perform here. To remove duplicate, first hold shift key on your keyboard and click on the sales right button of mouse is click and select the option remove duplicates if you want change this name here you can change this name here whatever you want data list unique data list data report you can change this name here now go here close and load to select this option now select the existing worksheet select this cell and press ok you can see result now here something is different if we compare the second method result, this is additional row. You can see last name Ali start with small a. And in this name Ali is start with capital letter A. So you can see power query method is case sensitive. Unique method is not case sensitive. Here you can see Asan Ali in first record and there is no other record. Remove duplicate is not case sensitive. Power query is case sensitive. If we remove duplicates from here, we need an additional step. Click inside this data set, go to data tab and select this option. And go to this option and double click on this option. to open power query editor and click this step before removing duplicate. I need to make sure that everything has the same case. Now select that data column where is the problem. Go to transform tab here and select this and go to format option. Click on this and select the
capitalize each word by clicking on that so now you can see in data set that small letter ali small letter a is converted to capital letter a now go to remove duplicates it's automatically removed now click on close and load to go back to go back to excel and now we get the same result as you see in unique formula method now go to this record control c copy this and paste here control v you can see no change here just change sale values you can see unique method automatically update but in power query method record is not automatically update to update this record click inside the data set now right button click on mouse you can see the window appear now in this window select the refresh option you can see this data set is update too so you understand this this is semi automatic if you compare the result with the unique formula and power query you can see the result is same okay so that it for today give this video like and subscribe to my channel i will see you in the next video thanks for watching and please subscribe to my channel